Could Shiba Inu truly lose one, maybe even two zeros this year? We're seeing more and more accumulation of Shiba Inu from Wales and retail investors right now as people get excited for the full launch of Shibarium. Now, we would take a look at the price as well as some interesting information coming out of Satoshi in relation to the Shiboshis and Shiba Eternity. So if that's something you're interested in, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Let's get straight into it. So Satoshi Kusama, obviously the lead dev of Shiba Inu, likes to keep us all guessing, likes to kind of be quite recluse when it comes to updates and upgrades for Shiba Inu. But he came out earlier and says, hashtag Shiba Army. Well, that's interesting. Hashtag Shiba Eternity. Hashtag Shiboshis. Now, for those of you that don't know, Shiboshis was a collection of NFTs launched on the Shibarium network. Excuse me, launched on the Ethereum network, but using the Shibarium ecosystem to do it. And it says the Shiboshis put a sudden explosion at sea, captures their attention, the Shibas are drawn by a beam of light from the depths and diving, leaving the shadow cats stranded on land. What lies beneath the surface? Only the Shib army know. And I think for me, this is a real clever play on the comic from the Shiboshis, what lies beneath the surface. And we can take a look in a little bit of detail at exactly what we think is going to come with Shibarium and why ultimately we're going to see a massive amount of Shib burned as part of this ecosystem. Now, looking at the Shiba Inu ecosystem, it's made currently up of four separate tokens. We have SHIB, which will ultimately be the main goal to deflate this token. If you take a look at CoinMarketCap, we are ranked the 14th highest ranked cryptocurrency, but the supply, similar to things like Terra Luna Classic, as well as other, you know, Dogecoin, the supply is massive. It was all the rage back in 2021, 2020, but ultimately to really start to push this into the potential realms of a dollar or even more, we have to remove supply. So SHIB being the ultimate native token of their entire ecosystem. We then have Leash, which will ultimately be a special token for loyal supporters of the ecosystem, also enabling holders to get exclusive perks and access. And it is also incentivized bone rewards for liquidity providers. Bone, as you know, will become the native gas token for the Shibarium network. And it ultimately, again, will become a deflationary token. And then you can see there that is blurred out Treat, will become a token that is given to the validators and people who are staking their Shibar excuse me, their SHIB to really incentivize people to lock in their tokens. What we do see, and we can see this quite clearly with Terra Luna Classic, is as the more amount is locked and is taken out of the circulating supply, the more stable the price becomes, and ultimately, therefore, the higher the price increase can come. Now, we also obviously have the link into Shibarium, the layer two blockchain, and there is a full uh, knowledge base example of what is coming where you can click in and have a look at exactly what is going to build up from the Shibarium layer two. This will all come out as part of the network. We can obviously see at the top here, we have the safety guides and Shipedia, which kind of gives us a little bit of what's going on for the Shiba Inu ecosystem. Now, what you might be thinking is, okay, two bit, we get all that. You've spoken about that. What is and why are people getting excited? Well, here is kind of a part to that. So we do know that it's common knowledge Shiba Inu is among the most popular cryptocurrencies in the world, with investors keeping a close watch on the token's price movement. CoinMarketCap, a leading cryptocurrency aggregator platform, has shared new data to support the claim in its Q1 report. Now, these are all relatively interesting information because it, what it does is it allows a sentiment for cryptocurrency at the same time as where we have interesting projects such as Shiba Inu that we like to cover on this channel as well as you guys like to watch. But Shiba Inu, more popular in North America than Europe. Now, this is important because in North America and particularly the US is obviously two things. One it is a hub of cryptocurrency right now, but two, it's probably been as regulated and as attacked from regulation as anywhere else in the world right now. So if people are still continuing to buy a token or a project, that should give you some real confidence to exactly why people are doing that. So as per the data, Shiba Inu is viewed as a popular crypto in different continents, such as Oceania, South America, North America, Africa, Asia, and Europe. The leading canine-themed cryptocurrency asset has over 12.5% view amongst the residents of different regions, such as Africa, Asia, North America, Oceania, and South America. However, Shiba Inu has lower popularity in Europe, with a record of only 11.56. In contrast, North America is a popular hub for Shiba Inu after an asset class record 20.39 percent amongst investors in the continent. Now, we can take a look at this document and this picture here. And ultimately, therefore, you can see how many this splits and what it splits across a number of different facets and tokens. You can see there, though, but North America with a massive line share of Shiba Inu. Again, my point here is that we know that regulation is coming. We know that actually in the US, regulation has been aggressively implemented. And we know that people like Elizabeth Warren really going after cryptocurrency for such, for 
ship to still have such a stronghold in that part of the world really for me solidifies exactly what's coming down the line with Shiba Inu. Now, like back to the start of the video where I talked about could we lose one, maybe even two zeros. Again, so we're talking about Shiba Inu being a real stronghold in North America. But again, we talk about burns. The ultimate desire to remove supply is about burning the token. So over 2000% of Shiba burn, according to the latest statistics from Shiba burn, Shiba Inu experienced a remarkable surge in its burn rate on April 1st. The data showed an increase of 2,025% in a burn rate which resulted in the burn of over 200 million ship tokens as of this writing furthermore the total number of ship tokens burnt has now surpassed 400 trillion so let me context this shibarium is going to launch with a number of different projects built on their specifically designed and partly of their utility is to remove supply of shiba inu tokens we know that the actual network itself will remove shiba inu tokens we're getting a two thousand percent increase in burn rate just before we even launch shibarium and the network so we could see anything into the millions of percents of burns for Shiba Inu. This ultimately is what we want to see, a massive reduction in supply, a massive increase in utility, and ultimately awareness, and the layer two part of the Shibarium network could really start to make something different. It is going to be huge. It's absolutely going to change the dynamic of both Shiba Inu and potentially even the blockchains that we have out there as the first real community-driven layer two. This could be absolutely insane. As ever, though, we'll bring you up to speed. We'll keep you updated and also bring you the latest with Shiba you and that burn rate as we get ever nearer to seeing shibarium launch like i said we'll keep you up to date so be sure to subscribe to the channel come and join our live streams 4 p.m every single day we talk about the latest and greatest in crypto take a look at technical analysis as well as giving some price predictions allow you to make the best decisions for your portfolios this year as ever thank you so much for watching this video don't forget if you made it all the end to subscribe to the channel leave a like and a comment down below let me know what your view is on shiba inu are you still bullish or has that ship already sailed but thank you so much i'll see you in the next one Bye bye